How in the process do you ensure that local artists in this community can afford to stay here? How do you maintain a community that is working class people live here as well as the wealthy people move over their condos? One of the things we know about gentrification and when it doesn't happen is when there's participation. And the participation that we're looking for, which allows a strata of, of, of affordable living, how does that participation begin? The late Amos Wilson said, if we desire a better world, we must name the world we desire. We really need to think about this issue with charter schools and issues of transparency and accountability and what's get, what gets lost. You can't change the past, but you must be present to change the future. Right. And that means organize. And organizing is all about love and a future. Love and a future. Revitalization without gentrification is hard work. Organizing is all about engaging people with a common table. Jack, the point that you were making over and over is that this really came down to the activism that came from everyday people. That's right. Come up. We're moving from a transactional form of organizing to what is a deeply troubling form for most of us, and that's transformative organizing. I can't change the world, and I can't change the system unless I change myself. Walk in your schools. Walk in your churches, walk in your synagogue, walk in your temple, walk in your mosques. The third step of this transformative model for us is that it has a deep wellness component. We can't displace people anymore. You know, we have historic preservation for buildings. We have to have historic preservation for neighborhoods. There are a lot of middle class folks who would like to be involved in making things better for everyone. And I don't think we'd had that kind of conversation. We'd had very kind of divided conversations. Conversation, a turning together in a willingness to embrace asynchronicity so that something new may emerge. Walk in anything that has a door, guess what? We are not against revitalization. It's in the how. We are against and the gentrification. So that's our starting point for this project and we invite everybody and anybody to join us for exploring when is not gentrification. And keeping the dialogue going.